So the other day I was just reading the Communist Manifesto and I had this thought, what if Minecraft was communist? And I thought, wait, Minecraft needs to be communist. And the more I thought about it, the more I realized Minecraft has these big issues that need to be fixed. Like, let's just start in the menu screen. Look at this. Look at all the, oh, oh, this is disgusting. Look, Minecraft, Minecraft, like it, it's yours. Is this just yours or mine? No, it's everyone's. Why can't it just be one person have the mine of the craft? And look, single player, why would you not play with your comrades? And Minecraft realms, oh, that is literally just capitalism. And look at these villagers, look, trading for goods? They're trying to, this is capitalism. I just can't stand for this, guys. So I've just gone ahead and started with the title screen. I'll go ahead and fix everything else in a second, but let's just look at this. Honestly, this is just so much beautiful. Look, our craft, everyone can have it. It's everyone's. Also, yeah, I had to remove single player because, yeah, look, it's not even an option anymore. Just because why wouldn't you play with your comrades? Because you need to play with everyone. You can't just play by yourself. What could you be doing by yourself over there? You need to be part of the community. Also, yeah, Minecraft Realms. Yeah, that's just capitalism. Of course it had to be removed. Options too. No, no options anymore because it's everyone. Something, I don't know. And quick game, yeah, of course, no leaving. Duh. I mean, why would you want to leave anyway? But even with those changes, we're nowhere close to fixing this. Also, yeah, I changed my skin. I thought it was pretty necessary change. But yeah, anyways, guys, take a look at this. Look at this. This, all this individuality. Why would you need to express yourself and be express your differences when you are all one community? Oh, this, this is... I just can't stand for this. Guys, now look at this. This is true art. Look at this, Joseph Stalin. Joseph Stalin, oh, there he is again, oh. Oh, look, it's Karl Marx, oh. Look, a perfect example of the true communist worker. Oh, look, it's the space race too. Yes, supports the Soviets in the space race. This isn't propaganda, this is... Hey, hey, look, it's Karl Marx. Also, guys, books. What kind of information could you be spreading with a book? Like, why do people even need books? So I made it so that every single book becomes the Communist Manifesto, the only book anyone would even want to read. And let's talk about music, too. Like, again, expressing yourself, individuality, not allowed. So the only music disc we have is the National Anthem of the USSR. And, and yeah, I get it. If you're if you're not in the mood for that, that's okay. We have other options. Every other music disc has become Manifesto of the Communist Party by Karl Marx and Friedrich Engels. Yeah, you can follow along with your own Communist the Manifesto. Spectre is haunting Europe. The, the Spectre, Spectre of, of Communism. communism. Oh, what a wonderful piece of literature. Also, of course, we changed banners to. Yeah, I mean, this one's pretty self-explanatory, to be honest. Like, look, we can do some redecorating, too, at this house. Look at this beautiful communist household. So beautiful. Also, in case you're wondering, so far, almost everything is a resource pack, and you can download it in the description. Because I know all you commies out there want to make sure you can play this. But guys, we are far from done. Look at- look around me. Look at this village. Their entire society is built on capitalism and socialism. So I fixed that by completely removing villager trades entirely. Look at these guys, these true communists, shaking their heads to capitalism. True communists right there. You wanna trade with me? No. You wanna trade with me? No, yeah, that's what I thought. You wanna trade with me? Ex excuse me? Th guys, th guys, I'm freaking out. Get out of my country, leave. <sighs> Uh, I'm sorry guys. I put put the sword away. I I just can't even believe someone would have done that. But it, it's okay guys. Remember, he's gone now. It's not an execution if no one was there to win. Alright, now real quick guys, let me show you what would happen if you were to do something, I don't know, capitalist or something bad. I would I would never actually do this. But like if you were, then th this is what would happen. So again, I would never do this, but like 
If I were to have my own little house away from the community, doing my own private things, not sharing with everyone else, again, I would never do this. But like, if I were to have my own dwelling with <gasps> my own storage, separate from everyone else, private storage, this, oh, this is making me sick. But if I were to do this, this is what happens. The yes, you have been sent to the gulag. It's what you deserve, you dirty capitalist, yes. Yes, this is this is what they deserve. They deserve to be sent here. Um, how do I how how do I get out? Comrades, help me! No, 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 no! Comrades, help me! Subscribe! No!